I mean, when you've got a guy the size of Jesse Hogan floating around the centre square as well, that makes a difference. What about his performance on the weekend? Did you think, think he had that in him? Um, yeah, he's, he's, he's very fit. So we knew he could run and, and, and do a lot of stuff around the ground. But um, I didn't know he'd be taking marks in the back line this weekend. So to see that, I mean, we've got to work on our structure a little bit as well because he is the only person over 190 centimetres in the forward line. So mm. we need him up there as much as we can. But when he comes in the middle, he, he, he manages to make it a bit of an impact and it goes well. But that was an enormous performance from him. Like had 26 possessions, I think, and and was clearances and was marks and contested footy. It was, and that's something we wouldn't associate. Footy fans wouldn't associate with Jesse Hogan. Is, is that something that's he's trying to add to his game, or has been trying to add to his game, or it was just a necessity on the weekend? Um, he probably had it from the get go, but we used him as a full forward, okay. just yep. just uh, straight straight forward. So um, he probably had all that midfield quality that we see now when he was 18, 19. But he has worked on his game. Um, to have someone like that, I mean, Hawthorne have used Ruffhead over the time and Rewald and Richardson are probably two guys that come to mind yep. in recent years. To have someone like that so you can bail out and use them on the wing, but then they can come in and win their own ball, it's, it's a pretty handy player to have. And you've got the Hawks this weekend on Sunday. Uh, what do you make of them so far in 2018? Um, I've always been a big fan of the Hawks, even last year at times when they weren't going as well. Um, the way they play their footy is is the way majority of teams want to play. Their uh, inside mids are balls and uh, their skills around the outside are superb. So um, it'll be a good little battle just to see where we're, where, where, where we're at. 